When did Bionicle come out? Bionicle Kick came out in 2003, I think. Because this is 2002. <laughs> Hello, everybody. You, miss, uh, you met us right in the middle of a conversation. Welcome back to Quick Plays. This is Dr. Muto for the GameCube. It's... That yeah, was that was the reason we were talking about Bionicle just now is... This game's graphics, when you see them, they aren't great, but they look better than Bionicle's, and they came out before Bionicle did. Yeah. <sighs> Alright, uh, so... This was a weird... Strange game, <laughs> same word, uh, released for the uh, GameCube in 2002 by Midway, which no longer exists. Do they have surround? Yeah, they do. This game has surround sound. Well, ah, uh, well, there's the controls. Okay, the game. This might be at the very end of the game. Yeah, I if I don't think anyone's gonna be worried about Doctor Muto spoilers. It's yeah. not a bad game. Yeah, it's I really like it. even it's checking on the hub. I think even checking online, the ratings were something around uh, six point five out of ten, which isn't bad. Do you want to play it? Because you're the one who played this a lot more than I did. I don't know how to play it. <laughs> I don't know even more than you do. Uh, it says C stick and. Either a control stick or yeah, control stick and C stick are the camera and movement. Uh, D pad left and right cycles your morphs up and down the D pad, bring out your HUD. Um, singly ta tapping A once uh, makes it makes Muto or the durable uh, jump. Uh, double tap for a double jump. Uh, holding A will after jumping will cause Doctor Muto to hover. Um, for Doczilla, single tap to jump, double tap for butt stomp. Uh, pterodactyl, single tap to stop flying. Spiny dockfish, whole day to swim. How do I change my? Uh, left more? and right. I only have and, mouse apparently. And then press Y. Are you sure? Yeah, it seems like I only have the mouse for some reason. I thought I finished this game. I'm positive you finished the game. Um, what? I fell through the world. Wait, did you? Because I wasn't looking. I was looking at the. It appeared so. Wow. That's sad. I'm pretty sure this was the only save file that was there. Yeah, I, I know I finished the game, but it seems I only have the mouse. And this is the only card that had a save file on it. Uh, I'm trying to look around and see if this mentions any of the morphs. Or maybe you can only use the mouse here, and the other ones you have to be in a level 4. Or did I fall off that? But I know I fell through the world or something like that. Hmm. Well, let's get to a level, and we'll see if we can do anything else. I'm trying to find the... Well, I just yeah. went through that. I'm trying to find a level. This is a bit of a confusing hub. Is there no purpose to coming up here or something? Uh, there appears to be no purpose what, to coming up What's that up thing here. in the middle of the room? Is it just the... I think that's just a thing. Okay. Is there something you have to interact with? Is there a warp room? Yeah, it's probably a little better running on this mute up right now. It's like the Doctor Cortex of <laughs> so many. Oh, Doctor Cortex is a silly guy. Okay, yeah, it looks like you have everything there at least. At least you've at least been everywhere it seems. I don't know which place to go to, so I guess I'll go here. Alright. Um, okay, entrance as good as any. Uh, oh, there are codes. There's a code screen. Uh, oh, it seems to be a water world. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. You can only do, you do specific morphs depending on what level you're in. I don't know who that was. So now you are a loading screen. You're a fish. Wow. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. This is a very unique... I don't even know if I could say a unique game, but... It's... It tried something. Am I gonna die? Nope. Yeah, yeah, he puts on water wings when he goes in the water. Okay, let me try to turn back the lab. Right. Let me see if I can go to other places. Alright. Not 
sure where the last place is. Ooh, there's a coupon in the back of this uh, for one dollar off purchase of any two Langer's juices. Ooh. Did you know that for four years running, an international judging of all major brands Langer's Scramble juices were deemed to be the best tasting by a panel of executive chefs? Oh, Why is this in... <laughs> what are the... Let me see the picture of them. Look, it's Langer's Cranberry. Oh. Why is this in the Dr. Muto manual? It's not even the back page. It's inside the middle of the manual. Well, they, they are good. <laughs> I guess so? I drank them before. <laughs> Disclaimer, this is not sponsored I don't by Langer's. Have the thing for this? Mm -hmm. So I didn't finish the save? So it must be on another I, save. But this is the only card we have with Dr. Muto saves. I don't know. It seems that I never finished this. I'm gonna jump in the top and see what happens. Cult King. And freaky flyers. I'm gonna try to kill myself and see what happens. It's probably gonna be a silly death animation. Or no, it'll just do that again. <laughs> what other places are there? Why is... Uh, I think you can go everywhere right off the bat, you just can't if you progress want to, if you don't have everything unlocked. If you want to unlock the morphs, there's a code to unlock all the morphs. I kind of want to see you show sure, morphs. Uh, it says you have to go to the code screen, which might be on the pause menu. Yeah, I, I don't even have this place unlocked. Seriously? Yeah. Well, there's a, there's a code for all areas unlocked as well. Yeah, I actually haven't been to some of these. I haven't that even been so there. That is so weird! That is so weird! I could have sworn. Alright, no, I finished Go to the pause menu. Uh. Master plan? Uh. Is there a thing I'm supposed to be looking for? There's, there's supposed to be a. Oh, wait, yeah, there was bottom. Cheats. Um. Oh, all, wow. There's all areas unlocked. It's beaming me up. Oh good, this this is the best code screen. It's what? Beam me up. B E A M. Well, I don't know how to spell beam. Okay. Just, up is U P. I don't know. Is there a space? No, no spaces. Uh, all morphs is Eureka. Secret morphs is log with two G's and then another log with two G's. Wait, beam me up. Yeah, beam me up. Oh, so there's two M's. Yeah, there's two M's. Okay. This is exciting. <laughs> Useless as a reference, I guess. Hate these type of things. Yeah. Couldn't they have just put in a pad? They could have put the spaces in because there was room for it. Whatever, though, I'm not going to question it. Yay, oh, it go anywhere. Alright, and for all morphs is Eureka. E U R E K A. Yeah, that's what you'll say. As a word, I don't. <laughs> e U R E K A. It's not a word I use every day. <laughs> but, um. Okay, I'm guessing there's the spaces are involved. There are no spaces. Yeah, I mean, like at the end. Oh, right? yeah. I'm, to to change I'm sorry, everybody. I can't really help the fact that this e is a terrible code screen. E U R A. E K A. Oh, E. They said A. Yeah. K A. I mean, at least this code screen makes a little more sense than the code screen on uh, Lost World Jurassic Park did. That was just weird. And lock every morph, mm -hmm. and there was also secret morphs if you want to put that code Ooh, in. What are secret morphs? L O G G L O G G. What? Does it unlock the log? <laughs> Uh, anyway. There's a couple other things. All FMVs uh, don't take damage. Invinci Wait, what? Don't what? take damage and invincibility are both separate codes. Super ending. Uh, oh, I think yeah. it's supposed to spell lug lug like you're drinking the potion. Oh, that would actually make sense. Yeah. Because that's how he does um, morph, if I remember. Yeah, okay, that actually makes sense. Here are bonus tips to help you through the game. Tip 1. Be sure to explore individual areas of each world thoroughly. You never wear no one will find a hidden item. Tip 2. Use your master plan to get a summary. Tip 3. Missions can only be accomplished at a later time. Yeah, I can't use them here though. Well, yeah, that, that makes sense. But hey, you can go everywhere now. So I guess I'll go. So have your fun. 
fear. Interesting. This might be the final area. <coughs> Ten minutes in, we're just now getting to real gameplay. Oh no, flying through rings. Oh great. Let's see, we have the fish. The gerbil. Oh, fish. It's fish with the gerbil. gerbil. Wait, neither of those are a pterodactyl. Oh, it's a... Oh, oh that's the pterodactyl. Okay. That wasn't what I expected. Well, what? I turned back. Okay. That was not what I expected at all. It's a flying squirrel. That is a flying squirrel. You know, that's not how flying squirrels work, but you know. Hi. Uh, oh, this is a little overpowered. I can just fly right up to the top. Yeah, wait a second. I'm just gonna straight into that thing right there. I'm kind of concerned as to why, what, the, how they use the secret morphs. Hmm. It's gotta be a level that I could use them all in. I'd assume the final boss, if anything. Wherever that is, I have no idea. Now I could just use what? Just use the bat here. I don't understand. Is this one of the secret ones, though? I don't think so because they because of the beginning of the other level it said you it said now that you have the pterodactyl, and I'm assuming this is supposed to be the pterodactyl. This is weird. I don't quite understand. Yeah, I'm a little confused. Right, I want to know what the secrets are. And there are definitely more morphs. The manual says so. It's right here. Hmm. That is so weird. I'm actually slightly disappointed. You don't want to search up on what the secret morphs are? I, I can't. While I'm exploring. Is it just those same two morphs there? Yeah. That is so weird. Um, Unless I have to press up and down on the D-pad, but I don't know. Maze on is apparently the final area. Well, apparently the end is the final area. Morphs. <coughs> oh, this is the final area. It says, also note, some areas are restricted to specific morphs, and some are completely more free. Oh. I can't even skip this. It says, as Dr. Lee, you can manually select the morph you desire by pressing left to right. Oh, there's a spider. What was this? Did I do anything with it? I can't find anything on the secret morphs. Whoa. Wow. Well, this is overpowered. Wow. Holy crap. I, I don't I don't even have any ammo with me. It's just <laughs> okay, there it goes. Yeah, I can only use the spider here, so I went to all the levels and I can't use anything but those. What I don't get it. Also, apparently there's a glitch in the game where you can't collect all of the collectibles. That's kind of terrible. <laughs> there's gotta be a way to check those secret morphs. Yeah. Oh, I can go outside. Oh. You can see all the planets, too. Yep. He has water wings. Uh, what is this? Oops, I accidentally turned Good job. Mouse. Good job, Mouse. Oh, I guess he's trying to build that. I don't know what it does, but... Yeah. So... I guess that's. I guess that's it because we can't figure out where else everything is because 
The I save drowned. wasn't as complete as I thought it was. Oh. Well. I drowned to death. So yeah, that was Dr. Muto. It was certainly a game. Uh, thanks for watching, and I guess we'll see you next time.